Hello, this is Chris with CricketUsers.com. On the right, we have the ZTE Engage, and on the left, we have the Alcatel Authority. This is also known as the V8000. Uh, we've seen it as early as uh, May uh, at CTIA, so we already had a little heads up about the device. I didn't really know much about the Alcatel Authority. Uh, this cost $159.99 at Best Buy. You'll find this at most cricket stores for $240. 999. Both were released around the same time. This features ice cream sandwich, as you'll notice there, and this runs Gingerbread 2.3.4. Both of these phones are in airplane mode, so we don't get any notifications while we try to do our benchmarks. 4.3 inch screen, 4 inch screen. Both have uh, 480 by 800 resolution. Of course, uh, since they have the same resolution, the pixel density is a little bit more dense on the V8000 or the Engage. 233 pixels per inch while this has 217 pixels per inch. 1900 milliamp hour battery right here and 1500 milliamp hour battery right here. Now a lot of uh, specs uh, revolving the Alcatel Authority aren't really published, haven't seen much on them. It does have a single core 1400 megahertz processor just like the Engage and I'm thinking both of them might be the Qualcomm Snapdragon S2 MSM8655. This does have a um, higher megapixel uh, rear facing camera sensor, 8 megapixels there, 5 megapixels here. Both have VGA front facing cameras, but we've kind of saved this in some other videos, so let's just get right on to the benchmark. We're using a uh, Quadrant Advanced, and we'll start these at the same time and see what the results are. So if you're really looking for a, a bargain phone and you don't need to be living closer to the edge of technology and uh, Android OS releases. The Alcatel, Alcatel Authority actually really impressed me. For $159.99, um, I think it's better than the, uh, the Sen 2. Um, kind of with the screen kind of on par with the Mercury in my opinion. Uh, a lot of people really do love their Mercury's, but to me, when I saw the Mercury, I was thinking, just a little bit less than the Droid Incredible. That's what I had uh, in my mind. And the Droid Incredible, of course, uh, is really old. There's There's been so many releases of the Incredible since then. Uh, when I look at the V8000, I think of a, a more premium device, a little bit more premium uh, finish, like uh, the Photon Q with the uh, black chrome as well. Of course, it's not built like a Motorola device. Motorola devices are like built like bricks. So the Engage should have the Adreno 205. I'm not sure about the Alcatel Authority. Uh, when we get on to the Ninamark 2 test, uh, it'll tell us what processor, graphics processor they have. So, the V8000 did come out with faster uh, results this time. Uh, a device score of 2708 and a device score over here of 2524. Now, I had actually done some tests uh, once uh, I had used these devices a little and not off of a fresh reboot, and the Alcatel Authority had edged out a win over the V8000, but now, uh, after a fresh uh, restart, it looks like the V8000 uh, pulls ahead CPU 2990 uh, CPU 2817 it shows that they do have similar processors and they might have the exact same processor memory score of uh, 1450 1437 here IO 6664 IO 6351 2D509 2D439 3D1926 and 3D 1575 so it looks like these devices really do uh, perform just about the same. I'll run the test one more time and then I'll give you just the final total scores. And then we'll wrap up this video. Uh, stay tuned uh, to this channel to see more about the Alcatel Authority and engage. Uh, please like my videos. It helps me out a lot. It allows me to make new videos, purchase new phones. Uh, subscribe to this YouTube channel, like my Facebook page at facebook.com forward slash users, and join the forum. Uh, share your experiences, 
ask questions about Cricut Wireless, flashing phones, and more. All right, your device 2685 on the V8000 2755, so the V8000 or Engage uh, edges out another win on Ice Cream Sandwich, uh, Alcatel Authority on Gingerbread. Thanks a lot for watching my video.